guys, welcome back to Let's Play Persona 5 Royal with Elixir for Tea Games. On the last episode, we continue our way through the Mementos depths, er, continuing, continuing to explore the depths of this place, er, seeing all of the different shadows that are here within all the different cells, chatting with our friends, fighting a lot of shadows, you know, that kind of stuff. We managed to get past a lot of puzzles and stuff and have ended up at what looks like a place that's incredibly close to where the treasure is. Uh, so today we're going to be going on and hopefully finding the treasure. Uh, between episodes, I, I took a break, um, so I don't know if my friends have new stuff to say. Let's try chatting with them, shall we? <laughs> okay, that's that's not new. Hi there, Fox. Joker. So, oh, no, nope, I've read that one as well. Um, how about Mona? Joker. Nope, no, I've read that one as well. And then on? Hmm. Uh, nope, I've read all of those before. All right, well, with that done then, I think we could just go. Roger, let's go. We're counting on you, Joker. All right, I am dying to know what is down here, so let's go. Oh, hello, people. Hi. Uh, there's a tired businessman. Who is to blame for the multitude of problems in the world? I feel sick just thinking about it. All I could do really now is ignore it, I suppose. <laughs> what a load of shit! Hey, the world's not gonna get better on its own, you know. True. You need to make change for change to happen. Hello. It's best just to remain stagnant in life. I might lose the one place I belong if I put myself out there. I'm afraid of that happening. So I think I'll just stay as I am. What? Uh, your current situation should be what's scaring you. How is he okay with all this? An incredibly good question, Panther. Alright, it looks like... Oh my god, this is gonna be cool. The hell is this? It's huge. I didn't realize such a gigantic place existed here. Is this where everyone's treasure is held? Yeah, that should be the case. But this ominously bizarre air about it, it almost feels like a temple of sorts. Although... Look, th there's no point freaking out now. Come on, let's go. So you're not freaking out yourself, Skull. Um, I see. This used to be just a straight rundown, but because the grappling hook exists, they needed to give us an excuse to use it, I guess. Oh my god, that's cool. Oh my god! I am a sucker for flashy, flashy stuff like that. That's so good. That is so that cool. Okay, we are in the prison of Acadia, I think it was called. Ooh. Uh, and if we look over here, there's actually more people in cells. It will, it will grant all of our wishes. We'll be free from everything. Please save us all. Make all our dreams reality. And then if we go over here, there's even more of them. Ugh, oh, as long as I have it, I don't need anything else. Are you the Phantom Thieves? What are you doing here? Keep your hands off of it! Ooh, that was hostile. Hello there. Almost. It's almost time for my dreams to come true. And then we talk to this guy. Everything is coming to an end. My wishes will be granted. Well, that's not concerning at all. Let's uh, have a look around, shall we? That's a lot of red. Wow. And then if we go over this way, I think we can go down. Oh, man. We're in the shrine, by the way. Man. As if that's not ominous. What exactly is this a shrine to? Oh, dear. Hmm. This is... The depths of mementos is likely what awaits us down there. Are you ready to descend, Joker? Let's go. The hell? Look at how many there are. Are these all prison cells? And what's that thing in the middle? Whatever it is, it looks disgustingly grand. There are no other passages leading out of this room. It appears this is our final destination. The depths of Mementos. In that case, is the treasure of Mementos somewhere in here? 
That should be the case. I think you're right. I've never been here, but I can sense it. There's no mistaking that presence. If we get rid of it... If we get rid of it, the public should come to its senses. But something that large will be impossible to carry out of here. We just gotta make it disappear, right? If we can't move it, then we'll just have to destroy it. Yeah, that will work. Once we do that, the entire metaverse is going to disappear, right? This is finally it. Oh, I guess it's no surprise we've been discovered. That thing isn't gonna sit back and let itself get destroyed. Even the inmates are starting to liven up. How eerie. They're planning something. That must mean this thing's gotta be the treasure. It saved us the trouble of checking. Hold on. Something's off. Shido said the masses are allowing themselves to be held captive here. Could they truly be operating this gigantic system that eliminates intruders on its own? Prison guards and soldiers were very organized, too. Are you trying to say that someone else rules this place? Is it not the public? <laughs> what was that? We don't have time to worry about that. Leave it for later. All right, guys. We better not lose now. Let's hurry up and destroy this thing. Everyone, give it your all. All right, let's do it. All right, let's destroy this thing. Come. Um, I kind of feel like we should prepare for anything. Um. High counter is just physical attacks, but I do have enduring soul. Um, I think I'm gonna put on Seth because it has enduring soul. Um, I don't have Mark Akaja. That's kind of annoying, actually. I didn't bring Mark Akaja with me. Um, I might actually get Makoto in here um, instead of Fox. Mm, actually, instead of Ryuji, yeah, let's get let's get Ryuji out here. Also, Rivers in the Desert is back. I'm extremely happy about this. Alright, let's do this! Let's go. Get that defense. I feel like that's the most important thing. Get the buffs first. Okay. Our Mona could do Masakunda. And then I'll get Fox to do Masaku Kaja. Just judging by the fact that it's a security system. That was awesome, Mona. Nice one, Mona! Alright, well with that done, let's start hitting it. Okay, 250. Um, McCool can do Freydine. Okay, okay. I get the feeling this thing's got a lot of health. Okay, we're seeing a dead. We're seeing a dead. I was a little worried there. Uh, have a Fufudine. Okay. We are so good at dodging. This is wonderful. Have a Megidola. Uh, maybe a Freydine as well. Why not? You know, let's get silly. Uh, Mona could do a Miracle Punch. Actually, I should have done Garu. Oh well. Uh, Vorpal Blade? Okay, okay. Ooh, she got hit that time. Tag it! Okay, uh, Koga on. It's not resisting anything so far. Okay. She could do Vault Guardian again. Uh, I think I'll get Mona to heal? God, this song is so freaking good. Okay. Yeah, I'm gonna get Mona to heal us. And then I'll have Fox do Sukukaja again. And Masakunda has unfortunately gone out, but... Uh, that's okay. 
As long as we can dodge. <laughs> oh dear. Okay. Okay, it's fine. He's fine. Um, I guess I'll do Agudine. Okay, okay. Err... Uh, I guess I'll get Makoto to do free down as well. Um, actually I should have had her heal. Oh, oh well, it's fine. It's fine, it's all good. Err... Uh, and then have uh, Bufudine. Okay, okay. Mm. Nice, thanks for doing that. Okay, um... Megidola. Uh, and I'll have you do... Actually, I'm gonna have her heal herself. Let's go. Because um, I do want to lower its accuracy evasion. God, this go. song is so freaking good! Uh -huh. <laughs> okay. Seems hopeless if there are this many inmates supporting it. You fools, human, yet wishing to eradicate the desires of humanity. Who's that? Repent. The treasure's talking. I am revered as the granter of dreams for all who behold me. A being most commonly known as the Holy Grail. The Holy Grail. The prison of regression is representative of the collective desires of humanity. They wish to be chained down, surrender their cognition, and neglect the world around them. These feeble-minded common folk will make your social reform all for naught. The shared heart of the masses has fallen into an excess of indolence and transformed into a prison. Damn it! We're worshiping that thing! Thus, the only suitable end for them is to perish within the prison they wished for themselves. Get ready! Here it comes! Hell yeah! Well, that's just rude. I mean, you just come out here and hit McCall right off the bat? Rude. Um, okay, okay. I have Master Kukaja, so I think I'll <laughs> cast that this time. Um, that gives Fox a chance to attack. Uh, I'm gonna have McCall do the defense buff. Let's go. Um, I can actually have Yusuke heal McCall, now that I think about it, because they're... Mona, I want to do Masugunda. That one. <laughs> God, this song though. Okay, okay. Also, also. Oh, uh, no, I'll leave it till later. It's fine. Uh, I was gonna say a thing, but. Just something about, you know, the Holy Grail and hearts and playing cards that we learned in class one time. <laughs> anyway. Okay. Beautiful. Hell yeah! Alright, alright. Let's fight. Okay, okay, two to seven, not bad. All right, let's get free date in there. Ah, uh, seriously, such a good song. Oh my god. Okay, uh, have a Gardine. 
Okay. And then I'll have Yusuke do Bifidine. I'm assuming it won't have just new resistances suddenly. This is seeming difficult. Um, what shall kill? We're just gonna need to keep attacking. We'll eventually take it down. Hopefully. If it stops healing. Which it probably won't. Oh dear. Oh, please don't hit Fox. heals its color changes well that's not helpful we should probably stop it from healing uh okay masuki kaja let's get our buffs back up uh, i will have the code of vault guardian again there we go um and i guess i'll have Mona do Masakunda again. Preventative measures. Fox can attack. He's fine. Ugh. Okay, it's fine. I'll get Mona to heal this turn. Um, it's fine. Okay, okay. Attack repaired. Why was the attack put up? Oh, maybe she has a an automatic buff or something. I'm not sure. Anyway. I appreciate it. I find it funny that he says meow, even though he doesn't like being called a cat. I'm saying this now, um, 133 parts into this bow. series. people feel. There's no way we'll be able to steal their hearts. We've come here for nothing. This is horrible. You imbeciles are intoxicated by an undesired justice. This is the will of the children of man who have fallen into sloth. My shine is proof that they desire my existence. As long as humanity yearns for me, I shall never perish. Is this really what everyone wants? Stop thinking and be guided by the Holy Grail? We can't accept that. Yes. It's so frustrating. It makes me want to cry. But I... I will never agree. The humans I look up to aren't like that. No matter how painful reality is, it's all over if you don't try to change how things are. I'm not the only one who believes that. Everyone here agrees. We don't want to turn back into the people we used to be. That's why we risked our lives coming here. Mona-chan. He's right. Humanity already wishes for their distortions to be actualized. I am merely the being that will ultimately grant those wishes. Now, it is time I refrain from my place in this world and begin to encroach upon reality itself. That's a load of shit! Encroach? What is it gonna do? Hey, this doesn't look good! I've got a bad feeling about this. 
Mona, what should we do? I don't know what you are, but you can't keep arbitrarily deciding all this on your own. Humans aren't all stupid like you say they are. <laughs> Indolent, foolish humans. You shall offer your hearts to me. Now, the time for the fusion has come. Hey, the grounds! It's vanishing? <laughs> Hell no! I remember everything now. Ow. Is everyone okay? Uh, of course we are. Oh, hey, our clothes are back to normal. Look! Huh? Shibuya? We're back. We didn't come back ourselves, though. We must have been driven out by the Holy Grail. Did we lose? We can't give up. I know that, but... Huh? Shibuya? Is this what it meant by the fusion? Uh, what's going on here? What is? God, how come they're not seeing any of this at all? Gotta be shitting me. <laughs> huh? What is this, a dream? Huh? <laughs> the hell is this? What's going on? Kauru. Kauru! For real? What on earth? This is impossible. Why doesn't anyone notice this? Damn, looks like I should take this seriously. Huh? No way! Wait, what the... What's this pink stuff? happened to the world hmm? what's going on here oh, what the hell's happening here I can't believe this why is everyone acting normal don't they see this I hope those kids are safe in a world inside a game, right? Everyone else isn't seeing this?
Man, what great weather. Want to go for a drive? Hello. Yes, it's about tomorrow's preliminary meeting. Uh, the announcement for the new smartphones tonight. What are the Phantom Thieves all about anyway? Oh, man. Hearing that brings back memories. I feel so dumb for even believing they existed. It was fun news, though. Well, I doubt anyone believes they're around anymore. Why isn't anyone noticing this abnormality? It's probably because they don't feel that it's odd. What's wrong? Oh, I feel woozy. Uh, Futaba, grab on! Anton? Is this by the Holy Grail too? That son of a bitch! God damn it! What's this creepy ass shit about? Ah! to us. Those who have disappeared from cognition cannot exist anywhere. Disappear my ass! What the hell? Are you dead? Is this really it? No! No! Morgana, where did we go wrong? Oh, my fault. Because I brought you all there. That's not your fault. I didn't mean to. Uh, I'm... I'm sorry. The mission's a failure. In the end, your rehabilitation was not carried through. It appears I have overestimated you. Where did my teammates go? <laughs> you incompetent prisoner! The assistance that we provided was all for naught. Humans are more apathetic. And more foolish than I had thought them to be. The world will soon see its ruin. Ruin? You have lost the game. You were meant to bring change to mankind as a trickster. But it seems that was too much for you. In accordance to the game's rules, the defeated must pay a price. Your life is forfeit. I sentence you to be executed. <gasps> executed? 
God's decree is absolute. My experiment has come to naught. Everything is over. Grant that man a swift death. If that's what our master wishes. It, it just means that you weren't an upstanding prisoner. That may be true, but... What is the matter? Carry out his sentence at once. Are we really going to kill him? Don't falter now! It's all his fault for losing the game! All right, inmate. We now proceed to the execution of your sentence. Where are my teammates? They're going to kill me at this rate. I need to do something. Insolent to think you'd still show your rebellious will after all that. Ready, Justine? If our master orders so, then it cannot be helped. Let us show our strength to this prisoner who just doesn't know when to give up. Understood. Death to the criminal. One's final moment should be spent in good grace. Eat this! Here goes. This power! Caroline, it's as I thought! What's the matter? I told you not to falter! Are you going against our master's orders? Take this. No, this isn't right. Our duty isn't to kill him. Caroline! What gives? Why am I doubting myself? Is there another duty left to us? I believe I ordered his execution. Uh. Uh. Master, have you forsaken humanity? We are wardens, those who rehabilitate prisoners. What? Something speaks to me in my mind. Our true duty is not to kill. I can hear someone's voice. Please, help! This voice... I feel like I've heard it somewhere before. What should I do? What should you do? Our desire is for you to complete your true rehabilitation. We are not executioners. That is the truth we had forgotten. We've decided. We will not forsake humanity. <laughs> Your right eye... and my left. It's as if they're the same. Yet mirrored. for our wish to be realized. I finally remember how we were torn apart. Torn apart? We were originally one. 
Yet we were torn asunder into halves by malevolent intent. <laughs> so we were captives, same as you. Huh. To think we'd learn that truth from a prisoner. Let us reclaim our true form. Hey, we'll give you your last job. Be thankful and obey. You must fuse us together with your own hands. That'll turn you back. It's time you return the favor for us assisting with your growth. Do it with care. Now, fuse us! Time to save you. My name is Lavenza. I was torn apart by a malevolent will and took the form of those twins. I sought help before my body was split in two. A malevolent will? If we lose you, the path to the Holy Grail will forever be closed. That's why you must recall the truth once more. And I beg of you, please, save us. I believed in you. I knew that you would make it thus far. And to the scoundrel who has swindled my master's name, your lies shall work no longer now that my sight has been restored. The game isn't over yet. Whether the human world is left as is, or destroyed and rebuilt, it is all sport to me. Be careful. If you're not Igor, then... If I were to put it into words that you can comprehend, I am the Holy Grail that grants wishes. No. It may be more accurate to say that I am a god who responds to desire and holds dominion over man. I hope seeing a righteous thief vanquish evil would spur mankind to change their own indolent hearts. However, the result is, as you know, the masses have made it so none of it has transpired. Humans should be met with ruin. You brought forth that answer. But to be frank, inmate, I believe it may be worth re-evaluating you. A human has reached the Holy Grail and has seen through my true identity. You've surprised the god that I am often enough. That cannot be done by a foolish commoner. You truly were a prisoner that did not bore me. I am thou, thou art I. Thou hast turned a vow into a blood oath. Thy bond shall become the wings of rebellion and break the yoke of thy heart. Thou hast awakened the ultimate secret of the fool, granting thee infinite power. Observing you a while longer may prove amusing. I shall grant you an opportunity to make a deal with me. What do you mean? Should you wish it, 
I shall return the world to its prior state, one rampant with distorted masses. Revert the world? Could it be telling the truth? You forcefully dragged him into the metaverse and imposed an ordeal he did not deserve. Yet you still intend on toying with him? The Phantom Thieves will be praised and gain fame. The world will escape ruin as well. What say you? If I agree to this, the ruined city will return to normal. However, the people will remain trapped, abandoning their ability to think for themselves. Is that really how the world should be? I refuse. Well said. Such irredeemable foolishness. You choose death for yourself. Very well. I have no need for you. Master! Ah. Oh my, it's been quite a while since I last stepped foot in this place. Welcome to the Velvet Room. My name is Igor. I am pleased to make your acquaintance. He is the rightful master of this Velvet Room, the true aid on your journey. I am so lost. It may be difficult for you to understand this all at once. If I were to summarize this, the fake has left, and the real has returned. Indeed. My master has returned, and you won against that malevolent god's temptation. Thus, you may be able to save this world that is headed towards certain ruin. However, it will prove difficult to win against him with your power alone. I know. You must release your teammates, with whom you've shared your conviction. <laughs> this place exists between dream and reality, mind and matter. They have not necessarily expired yet. Just as you were trapped here, they should be confined somewhere as well. Since you've deepened your bond with them, I am certain you can release them. Once they, the Phantom Thieves, are all gathered here, we will tell you everything. Now go forth to the people whom you should be facing the truth with. The other Phantom Thieves should be present somewhere ahead. So please find them. Save them. This is something only you can do. I'll try my best, Lavenza. So hi, a lot just happened. <laughs> I hope you all are following this okay. Um, I am at least, but yikes. Look at all these cells. We can go into the marathon before, but now they're all busted open. And then if we go over here as well, then we have our own little cell here. We can actually go into it and see the back of it now. Oh man. And then Lavenza and Igor, I can't consolidate his proper voice with the sprite that he's had throughout the game because he will always just be the deep voiced fake god Igor when I see that sprite to me. It just looks so evil. Um, but yeah, a lot just happened. Um, I'm gonna continue playing the game rather than explaining things because the game will explain things as it goes. Hi, Lavenza, how you doing? The other Phantom Thieves should be in prison somewhere ahead. Uh, I read that before. All right, thank you, Lavenza. Yeah, um, the twins are, are and Lavenza. Oh, it's so good. It's so well done as well because we're fusing things throughout the entire game, and it's always the twins fusing and th fusing things. So we're constantly seeing that guillotine go, pfft, and then we have to actually use it on the twins. Oh, so well done. I love it. Okay. Well, with that being said, let's go and find our friends, shall we? That's kind of important. Um, we actually get to run around the Velvet Room now. 
Uh, so it looks like there's a bunch of cells that way and that way. Uh, what happens if we go up here? Oh, log staircase. Oh, a door! The door is tightly sealed. Well, fair enough. That is a tightly sealed door. Okay, well, if we leave again... Uh, let's go to this way first. Uh, see if we can find our friends. Uh, oh, cell? <gasps> Makoto! Hi, how you doing? Joker! What a relief. You're safe. Same goes for you. Huh? I... um... By the way, why have you remained in your Phantom Thief attire while I'm back in regular clothes? Could this mean that the will of rebellion is no longer within me? <sighs> that may be true. We have to fight that Holy Grail again, correct? Could you imagine defeating it, Joker? That monster has the support of the masses, and with it, nearly an infinite amount of power. No matter which way I approach the subject in my head, nothing points to our victory. I think I finally, genuinely understand the pain my father and my sister were burdened with. Victory against a single criminal is meaningless. The true enemy is society itself. And even against that foe, you still have to try to somehow emerge victorious. I don't know what to do. Believe in yourself. Believe in myself? Hmm. <laughs> you got me. Regardless, this isn't a situation with a straightforward answer. But even if there is no clear solution, I'll just have to make one with my own two hands. Before you guys came along, my life was defined by rules, set on a path of someone else's choosing. But only a true loser would live such a rigid life. I... I will win! Even if it means going up against the entire world. I'm okay. My resolve was shaken, but it's stronger now. I want the people of the world to see what you've shown me. Break time's over. Right. Thank you. Having teammates you can trust is a great feeling. Shall we go? We can't let our last big job end in failure. Hey, is everyone else locked up in this place as well? It seems so. I see. Then it could be that they're all still in the same state I was earlier. Joker, there don't seem to be any shadows around here. I'll wait somewhere nearby. In the meantime, I ask that you save everyone else. I'm sure they need your help more than anything. Yes. And, um, I think it would be best you go alone. Well, thank you, Mako. You're so strong. She's so strong! All of our friends are so strong. Let's chat with her. The others must surely be waiting for you. Please, hurry up and find them soon. Well, let's do that, shall we? Let's go and find our friends! Ugh! Okay, we've saved Mako. Let's go and chat with everyone else, see how they're all doing. Help them out if need be. Yusuke, how are we doing? Joker, as I expected, you appear to be safe. However, where exactly are we? Outside the Velvet Room. Velvet Room? I'm not sure I understand. At first, I was surprised to see the masses chained in a prison. Yet, here I am as well, considering the state of the real world. It is hard to say that we were even remotely helpful. 
This situation... Can we truly handle such horrid circumstances? All the Phantom Thieves can do is change the hearts of others. However, the world outside has become a veritable hell. Nothing within our power can fix that. The people of this world desired their enslavement. And that isn't all. They screamed at us for attacking the Holy Grail. Defended it. Even the criminals whose hearts we changed became meek followers of the Holy Grail because of us. Were we truly that foolish? Risking our lives for a result nobody desired. What about your justice? My justice? I see. Not that for someone else, but one strictly for myself. When we first met, you continued to impose yourselves on me, no matter how much I pushed you away. I will forever treasure what you did for me. Very well. Just as art is meant to break boundaries, people should be saved even if they frown upon it. I won't allow the justice I believe in to be shaken any further. Allow me to thank you, Joker. Being by your side truly gives rise to the greatest ideas. We should get moving. Ah, yes. We cannot afford to leave reality in the hellish state it's currently in. I will make use of my role as an artist and paint over the distortions of society. Well then, time to go and see this through. I'll witness with my own two eyes that this world isn't bound by some holy grail. Well then. Are the others here as well? I see, as I thought. We will be counting on you. In that case, I will remain here on standby. I ask that you go save the rest of our teammates. Oh man, Yusuke is so good as well. The voice acting in these bits is so good. Originally, it used to be that the first half of that scene wasn't voiced, and then like the moment that they get the resolve and change back into their Phantom Thief clothes, that it is suddenly voiced. So I'm glad it's all voiced now. Hi, Yusuke. I am so I entrust the rest of our team to you. I'm quite certain they require your assistance, Joker. Yeah, they're all strong, but they also need our help. I does he only have the one thing to say, or? Nope, nope, it's just the one thing. Okay, well, let's go and find more of our friends, um, because that's important. Uh, if we go up here, it looks like there might be more cells this way. Oh, hello. On! On, how you doing? Oh, Joker. Thank goodness you're safe. Same goes to you. Oh, yeah. Huh. So, I'm not in heaven after all. That means the hell that Shibuya turned into was all real. <sighs> I'm so weak. When I thought I was gonna die, I... started trembling. I was just so scared. At that moment, nothing mattered. The justice of our actions was the last thing on my mind. Joker, you kept going, even through a plan that might have ended up killing you. Yet look at me. I've always said I'm doing this for other people. But that didn't get me far. <laughs> it's no wonder we lost. Maybe I should have just behaved myself and stayed out of all this. What about Shio? That's... You're right. I can never abandon her. If I whine like this now, I'd just be betraying Shiho. No. I'd be betraying myself. I could never forget how I felt that day. I... I never want anyone to have to go through what I did. I've made up my mind. 
I'm going to keep looking forward. Things like dying or losing aren't important now. All that matters is that I don't return to my old self. I'll never make a mistake like that again. I swear it. Thanks, Joker. You helped me remember what's really important. I seriously treasure being able to be a part of your team. We should get going. Gotcha, Joker. It would be a disgrace to the Phantom Thieves name if we didn't take such a big treasure. We're going to put an end to this, aren't we? Let's go! Hey! I'm not the only one in here, right? Okay, I'll wait here. Hey. Please, go save everyone else. It's something only you can do. Thank you, On. She's so strong. We'll keep doing this for she who and for everyone else who suffered. Please, go save everyone. They have to be around here somewhere. I'm sure that they are. Okay. Well, we've saved three, so we've got a few left. Is that Haru? Haru! How you doing? You're safe. Oh, thank goodness. Same to you. R right. Considering everything that has happened to the city, I wonder if the citizenry is okay. Although, it seemed like we were the only ones able to see it. You know, the moment I disappeared, I honestly thought I was about to die. But... Part of me wasn't afraid. I knew that was all I could do, and looked forward to apologizing to Father face to face. Honestly, I thought I had changed, but I realize now that I still have no control over my life. It makes me sick. I'm sorry. I know you don't want to deal with my whining. You're going to try and defeat that thing again, aren't you? Don't push yourself to get me to come along. You can always leave me here if I'll slow you down. You control your life now. That's... That's right. I was foolish to think you should abandon me. Even if there are times where I think there's nothing I can do, I'll never stop fighting for you or our team. I won't give up anymore. Just as I betrayed my distorted father before, I will betray my boring former self now. Thank you, Joker. Before I met you, I had great admiration for the Phantom Thieves of Justice. And it's turned out you were exactly the person I always imagined you would be. This is the second time you've rescued me. I've secretly longed for a situation like this. We should get going. We haven't lost yet. Um, Joker, are the others here too? I see. I'm so glad. In that case, please go help them. I'm sure they all just need a little push to remember what they're fighting for. Um, that's why you should be the one to go. Alone. Thank you, Haru. You really are strong, and you're not- You're not slowing us down at all. You're so strong. I love her. Help you, it here. Please, go save everyone, Joker. Okay, I'm gonna go save everyone. Let's go find the rest of our team. Oh man, this is fun. This is fine. Ah! Alright, who's gonna be over here? Oh, it's Ryuji! Hi, how you doing? Yo, looks like we're both somehow still alive and kicking. But where at? I'm glad you're okay. Man, 
This prison cell kind of makes me think of when we first met. I remember how Shibuya was all effed up just now, but like, nobody was seeing any of it. No, it was more like they didn't want to see any of it. What the hell? So, even all them people who are suffering and cheering for us to come and help them, in reality, they would have rather just had everything stay how it was? Did what we were doing have any meaning at all? You know, back when I thought we were gonna die, without learning the truth about all this, I kind of felt for the first time that maybe we hadn't been doing the right thing. That Maybe we deserve to lose. You get me? I don't know. Now that I'm thinking about it, I, I started all this because of how pissed off I was. Maybe it's never been about winning or anything like that. Maybe all I was doing was just continuing my own defiance. So you're giving up? Uh, You're right. I get it now. We're doing this to make sure people don't gotta go through the same crap we did. It doesn't matter if they think we're just or not. We gotta do what we believe in. <laughs> it's not like people think much of me anyways. I'm gonna dash through this the only way I know how. You got me out of prison, just like before. Thanks. You know, it's kind of embarrassing to say this, but uh, I'm really glad I met you. All right, I'm done getting my ass kicked. That shiny bastard acts like it's some kind of god. I ain't gonna feel good till we deal with it. Let's head out. We're gonna take down that asshole, yeah? Hey. Hold on, you think the others are locked up too? Gotcha. Uh, guess I'll spend my time loafing around here then. We'll be counting on ya. You should go rescue them. I'm sure they're waiting for you. Thanks, Skull. Ugh. You're so strong, Skull. Ryuji. I love ya. I'm gonna leave the others to you. They gotta be here somewhere. Yep, two left. Just got Futaba and Mona to find. Let's go and find them, shall we? I also realized halfway through that scene that we never checked out um, the background for Astarte, Haru's new persona. We should really get on that um, once we get the, the entire party back together. Okay. Vitova! <gasps> hi! Oh, Joker. I'm relieved. Looks like we're both still alive. I'm glad you're safe. Am I really safe, though? Shibuya... What happened? And... Where are we? Somewhere safe. I see. I guess my fears turned out to be true. The real world is a scary place. Pain like this can never reach you if you keep yourself cooped up indoors. Who am I to think I can tell the people what to do? I mean, I used to be a shut-in myself. Damn it. I just want to go home. But even that would be tough now. Giving up would be too painful. You know, I think I've changed. I don't know when it happened. But I can't... I can't let people suffer like this. Even if I don't know them personally. Follow your feelings. Honestly, this all seems like a bit too much. But... But... What do you want? I... You're right. My heart has been set from the start. I don't want to run away from this. I ran from my mom's death for so long. I misunderstood it. Everything was just too painful for me to handle. But 
I never want to be left in the dark again. That's probably why my persona is a little bit special. Because I want to learn the truth. That's how I really feel. Well, I've come this far. I'll follow you wherever you go, on my own two feet. You have such a strong heart, Joker. You saved me yet again. Thanks. I'm so happy. Like, so much that I can't even express it in my normal words. Anyway, we're going up against a god. I couldn't even leave my own room before, but now we're gonna beat a god! I'm so pumped! And wait a sec. I just noticed I got out of here on my own. Ta-da! A real jailbreak! We need to go. Whoa, you're quick to act. That's what makes you dependable. All right, time to get back at it. It seems you have managed to save all of your teammates. Now then, please gather in this room at once. Huh? What? What was up with that voice? I mean, was I the last one? I couldn't find Morgana. Huh? What do you mean couldn't find him? What is this place? Who are they? My name is Igor. I am the master of the Velvet Room. I am Lavenza, a resident of this place as well. We have been waiting for all of you. Velvet Room? My master has just been released from a long period of imprisonment. His powers have not fully returned. Though it may be presumptuous of me, I will speak on his... Hey, where's Morgana? Would you like to see him? Of course we would. He's right over there. That's where you were hiding? I... was born here. It was to dispel an evil being from man's spiritual world. Mona? My role was to find the trickster and help him defeat it. That's why I was created here by my master. Indeed. I really remember everything. When this place was about to be taken over, my master gathered the last traces of mankind's hope. He mustered up his remaining strength to make me. The entity that calls itself a god is a malevolent will that forces man into everlasting servitude. It hopes to attain eternal peace by filling reality with those who have stopped thinking for themselves. That is the ruin of man that this evil god envisions. I... um... don't get what you're saying at all. Oh, be quiet and listen! We don't have much time left! W wait a moment. The Holy Grail is... a god? I was wondering why it had a will of its own, but... Are you implying that it isn't a treasure? No. As the distorted desires of the masses, it is most certainly the core of Mementos itself. Then, did the treasure become a god because people wish to be ruled over? That is correct. To decide the fate of the world, it chose two people with potential and pitted them against each other. One, Goro Akechi incited the masses' distortion. Had he won, the world would have been destroyed and remade. The other was a trickster who would stand up against this. That was him. If he won, the human world would be left as is. Those were the conditions of the game. At least, that's what should have happened. That malevolent being knew that a revolution would not occur within indolent humans. After all, it is the masses' distorted desires incarnate. However, my true master believed in humanity. He believed that a trickster would rise among the people and accomplish this change. But that evil entity laughed at the prospect and sought to prove the powerlessness of man with the game. 
and he had great potential, which is why it approached him. It helped train the trickster only to cast him into despair, using the masses who rejected their savior. This was likely its means to nip in the bud anything that would pose a threat. Now that I think back to when I was separated, I felt a disagreement to the word rehabilitation. Of course I did. It was just a means for the fake to keep you under surveillance. Basically, this guy was dragged into a game where the evil god rigged the outcome. Damn it! What the hell? Your real world has already been fused with mementos. You do not exist because reality is replete with the cognition of those who deny the Phantom Thieves. It can be said that the world is one step away from the evil god's machinations. However, there is still hope. Now that the evil god's identity has been exposed, you can see your rehabilitation to its completion. Only you can leave this prison and save this distorted world and its captive people. Young man, guided by Morgana and worthy of the trickster name, you must challenge the evil god and reclaim your existence in reality. Are you up to the task? Of course. Let's destroy that annoying shiny treasure jerk for sure this time! <laughs> Excellent. There is nothing to fear. You already possess the strength to oppose this evil god. <laughs> I am truly looking forward to this. Our mutual friend knows where the exit is. Morgana, please guide them. And thank you for all that you've done. It's a cruel responsibility that's been cast upon you. I will accept your words of appreciation fully when everything is over. Now follow me! The summary of the story up to this point has been updated. To read, press triangle to open the menu, then select story from under the system option. Joker! Let's go! Uh, in a second. Can I go back through here? Hi, Lavenza. Can I chat with you? Please be careful on your way. Okay, thank you, Lavenza. Bye. Well, oh, all of our friends are waiting. This way. It's up this way. Follow me. They ran quickly. Well, let's you belong with them. <laughs> oh, what's this? It's one hell of a door. That's our exit. Come on, let's go. Huh? We're back in Shibuya again? Oh, right. This is where we were when our bodies disappeared. Seems like people still haven't realized that this abnormality has taken over the city. Look, the door we just came through. If I remember correctly, this is that quarantine cell. That's right. It was actually the Velvet Room, which had been swallowed by the distortions. You did say you were born in there. It makes so much sense now. Wait. So if we came out of there, does that mean we're the criminals? No, it's more like him, since he was kept in here. Most likely, Joker had been under the malicious guidance of the evil god for quite some time. The Velvet Room originally existed to nurture the human mind. But after it was taken over, it was sealed inside that bastard's nest. Inside Mementos. Uh, Mona? More importantly... You're shining. It's probably because my memories have returned. I know what my duty is now. Uh, <coughs> whoa. Do you see something? Shining? Wait a sec, what, what's with those weirdly dressed guys? I feel like I've seen those costumes before. Oh, aren't they the Phantom Thieves? I kind of remember seeing a silhouette of them on a jumbo screen in the city. The Phantom Thieves? Oh yeah, that's right, I, I completely forgot about them. 
This is different from how it was before. Do they see us? It doesn't seem to be everyone, though. Only a handful of people in this large crowd. Maybe it's Kazumona's light. Either way, they remember the Phantom Thieves! Oh, the Key of Hope. Mona, guide us. Where must we go? Over there. The bastard from earlier should be in that temple. Well, hello there. Look at this. We have finally made it. Oh, hi, Habako. <laughs> we have finally made it. Oh my goodness, you're not shining anymore, Mona. <laughs> oh, wow. Well, this is cool. Uh, unfortunately, we've gone on for a little while, so I'm going to stop here for today. But first of all, those scenes, everything, oh my god. Uh, this is a, this is just such a cool build-up and everything. I love helping all of our Phantom be friends and hearing the truth about Mona. And honestly, that scene there where they explained everything, that's where I really started feeling bad for Akechi during my first playthrough. Because it's where I really understood he was not only being used by the people the humans. He was being used by a god as well. Just like Ryan was. So, you know, that happened. <laughs> anyway, it's the day of reckoning. <laughs> We're gonna go ahead and end off here for today, but next time we'll go ahead and see what the day of reckoning has in store for us and head for the temple where hopefully we'll be able to take down the malevolent god. Uh, but for now we do need to stop. So, hi. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this episode. Please feel free to let me know down below what you thought of everything that happened in this episode here today, including plot. So much plot. Oh my god, all of the plot. Wow. Um, next time we'll continue with plot. We'll hopefully go and make our way towards the, the treasure again. Um, maybe take it down this time. Who knows? But for now, we'll have to stop. So hi. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this episode. Hope you have a great day, night, or whatever the time it is for you. And I will see you next time.